Simone, probably the toughest time to come up against the Lightning after their week. How did you assess that performance? Oh, look, it was it was disappointing. Um, I just thought some of our basic play and basic basic skills were a bit sloppy at times today. I thought there were some, you know, our starts for every quarter that was uh, they were quite poor. So, you know, we need to have a look, have a chat about that. But you know, there was moments, but then there was moments where it was very clunky, hard work, and we often made hard work of it ourselves as well. Was it tough not having? bench to be able to change up. We saw you try to make changes within the, the seven that was on the court. Was that tough for you, coaching? No, I thought the um, the changes, you know, you're trying to find that difference. At different times, there was different things that um, that weren't, weren't working. So you're trying to find that, that little piece that might change that around. Um, but, yeah, it was a tough one. Just on the, the starts of the quarters, what was it that went so wrong for you guys at the start of the quarters? No, it's interesting because we've actually been pretty good. We've been strong starting the game. Um, and the first start of the first quarter, I think, you know, what was it? It was, I don't know. It was 0-6, zero six, yeah. I think. <laughs> and, but I thought we came back into it really well, got ourselves back, finished that quarter strongly, and then the very same thing the next quarter. So, you know what, I, I, we have to have a chat about that because that's something about that you're not stepping onto that court ready in some ways. Yeah. So for you in that goal circle, we saw a pretty good performance from Irvin and Hinchliffe, which, you know, before the game we were thinking that you and Kira really assert yourself in there. And talk to us what it was like playing against, I guess, Irvin with her big arms and what it was like in there for you. Yeah, I think, um, I don't know, we probably just weren't disciplined. I don't think... I probably lacked a bit of movement. I think the last couple of weeks what I've really added to my game is that movement and coming out and being that strong option. Um, but I thought I would just sit in there this today for the first half. Um, so I think we probably just didn't play our brand of netball, which is that fast ball movement, um, multiple options um, in that attack end. So, yeah, they're obviously very rangy um, and we probably didn't adjust to that. Um, but I just don't think we were playing our game, which is probably the most disappointing thing, um, especially after that first quarter and you know finishing it quite strong. Um, I felt like that was great momentum to keep going, but we probably took our foot off the gas. So you did eventually go to your bench there in the last quarter, but what was the thinking behind persisting with that starting seven, albeit in different combinations for so long? Because um, I thought it was, um, it was chat, chat. At times I thought it was actually doing, they were doing a good job and at times it was opening up. I thought it was more so that the ball was coming down, back so much. We were sort of, you know, forcing and losing ball down the attack end, which meant it was just transitioning and coming down really quickly. Doesn't get any easier next week. No, <laughs> no. What's this week going to look like? It's a bit of a cliche to say, you know, a loss you learn so much more from, but do you think you will... Will re-galvanise. No, well, you have to. You know, I mean, super disappointing, super disappointed about today, but you have to. And you have to get on to the next one. And you know, it's probably one of the biggest challenges in the comp. So <laughs> you've got to be excited about it. You've got to get on to it. You can't feel sorry for yourself or think shoulda, coulda, woulda. It's like, right, oh, next, let's go. Just one last one for me. How did you see Rudy's game? As someone who hasn't had consistent court time, stepping up into that wing defence role playing against someone like Liz Watson? Oh, I think at times, and generally across the board down at that defence end, we probably got pulled for too much contact. Um, I thought Rudy did the job that was asked of her, um, and I've got to commend her on that.